I am gonna make something I've never made before. We're gonna make a patty melt. I have never in my life, somehow, some reason, made a patty melt. But in my mind, and a patty melt is a grilled cheese with a burger inside of it. No? Yes? Let me know in the comments, you fucking idiots. <laughs> Thank you, Butcher Box, for sponsoring this cooking something. You want to have the best freezer full of the best meats? Right here, Butcher Box. Burgers, tacos, meatballs, every single thing that you love. Fill up your freezer with the Butcher Box, baby. Okay, it's high quality meats right here. You want to go to the grocery store and be like, uh, what do I get here? You got to pick up the thing, you look on the back. What's this? Where's that from? I have no idea. What is that? Oh my goodness. Did you know? No more did you knows. Right here, ButcherBox did the knows. They know what's good for you. It's yummy, it's delicious, it's perfect, comes right to your doorstep. Are you kidding me? Imagine two pounds for free, for life, with every membership. You get free beef, grass-fed beef from ButcherBox. What? Click the link below in the description, okay? Click clack, little babies. Let's go. Fill up that freezer full of good beef. It's grass fed. Ah! Have a great day. Ah! Butcher box! We got a big old pile of ground beef. Beef boy. Beef girls, beef people, beef thems. We got bacon, we got onions, we got cheeses. We got some really great bread here. We got Swiss cheese. We got a nice sharp cheddar. Oh. This smells like the bottom of grandma's feet right there. You ever get the pumice stone out and kind of grind on grandma's feet? Oh. First things first, everybody. We're gonna take half a pound of butter into a pan. We're gonna melt that up. Let's just do like medium heat here. Just let it froth up a bit. And as we froth in, take some bacon. We're gonna cut this up. Kind of make like little lardon. Bacon's good. Do you guys like a lot of bacon? Yeah, yeah, bacon. So first thing we're gonna do is make some crispy bacon. Drop that in there. And now, while that's rendering out and getting crispy, we're just gonna do a little bit of a mix here. I got white onions, I got yellow onions. How many onions is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Eight onions. See, I did reverse math there. I counted 16 and then gave you eight. That's reverse math. Do they teach that in school? No. Honestly, like when I'm thinking of a patty melt, I want caramelized onions. I want sweet and savory. Onions are the best vegetable in the world. Salt and onions. Those are the two things you need. The bacon is rendering, the butter browning. That is good. And all that fond on the bottom, that's all gonna come up right now because look at this. Boom, and we're gonna add this. And we're gonna stir this in. We're not gonna put all the onions in yet. What's gonna happen is the moisture from the onions and the heat are gonna activate and create moisture down here. And that's gonna deglaze and we're gonna be able to scrape up all of that fond and flavor from the butter and the bacon. And we just kinda clean the pan. Look at that now, you know? This is what I'm talking about. Now we add the rest of the onion. Boom. Also, at this moment, add a little bit of salt is a good trick. Kind of gets that moisture out, and you want to do that as fast as possible. We are going to add a little bit of some cola. We got some vinegar, and we're, we're going to try to make this nice and sticky. It's already sinking down. You can see it. Pour that in there, and that's going to help steam but guess what? Fat and water separate. So the water will evaporate and the fat will still come down and keep coating. We're gonna get into some caramelization zone. And we're just gonna pat it down, keep that moisture in there, and then stir, 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 release. You can see all these bubble ups? That's that water, that's that fat, that's everything kind of pushing through, bubbling up. Give it a little stir. We're at the point now where we're gonna add half a can of cola. And now we're gonna reduce this. Keeping that high heat vibe. Red wine vinegar, like half a cup. All the liquids are in. Look at that. This is like soup right now. We gotta reduce it. We gotta reduce it. So now, 
For a patty melt of this size, six ounces. Put it into a Ziploc bag. Take a tray, and we're just gonna flatten it out. That's good. That's good locomotion right there. Let's see if we can get it right on the head this time. Look at that, 6.1. Okay, so we got two perfect patty melts here. The thing about a patty melt, you don't want some big, thick burger. You kind of want the ratio to be the buns, the pieces of fried bread, and then the burger. Every, but the ratio is the same amount. We are caramelizing. Look at this, doesn't that look good? We're getting some jam. We're gonna keep reducing this. I want this to be nice and tight and sticky. Now, let's season some beef patties here. Got a couple salts. Do some fresh cracked cat. Okay, getting the pan hot. We got beef patties salted and peppered. Okay, here we go. We got the burger patty in here. Don't touch it. There we go. And just a little bit of contact. I don't. You don't want to push it down too much. Let's butter up our uh, our bread here. We got the burgers on. We got the onion jam on. Here we go. We're gonna flip our burger patties. Look at that. I didn't put anything in this pan. Look at all that fat, look at that crisp up. I don't wanna cook these through here. I just wanna sear, that's nice color. And we just cook it lightly on the other side. Take that out, okay? Cause we're gonna put these into the oven. We're gonna fry these up, these pieces of bread. Yeah. Okay, now we're gonna start building this up. All right, let's grate some cheese. We gotta get our cheese ready. We got our toasted bread, Swiss cheese, cheddar cheese, burger patty. Here we go. Bacon onion jam. Mm. More cheese, please. Bread. Now let's do it again, okay? Patty melt, bacon onion jam. This is gonna be the best patty melt people have ever seen. I'll tell you that much. That makes sense to me. Now, see this makes me happy. I know that these are gonna be good. So, come on. We're gonna put these in the oven. We got an oven cranked at like 500 degrees. I'm gonna actually do a quick cleanup. When we come back, we're gonna pull those out and we're gonna have patty melts for the very first time. Are you fucking ready? Did you grab your fucking boots? Did you throw them on your Did you pull your socks up real tight? Did you get a it around your and it's coming out, come on, come on. Ah! She hot. Oh boy. Oh my fucking God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Every time. Look at this. Oh. Oh. This is fire. Wow. Hello? Like, look at the, the crisp. The crisp, the bacon onion, a fucking perfectly cooked burg. Oh my god. I need like six Pelotons or something, my asshole right now. You fuck. If you ever make anything on that, you know that it's the best. If you ever made the thing that I make, you know you fuck. Mmm. Thank you. Thank our sponsors. Let's have a great day.